We don't really know it, but we sense it. There is a sister ship to our life, which takes a totally different route. While the sun burns behind the islands, Thomas Transtromer, the Blue House. How did I end up here? My whole life, all its ups and downs, led me to this place. Far from home, far from anyone I know. A journey whose route is unknown. The destination, out of sight. Was this path just a random sequence of events that I had to follow? Or was there ever another way? Now, heading for the unknown, I can't really tell. Is this the end of the road? Or is it yet another branching? Colors look great for that. Hell of a storm we're in the middle of here. Flare here, red smoke. That's an emergency flare from my capsule. Should look out for those. Okay, look out for the flares. Got it. Hold our tea to run. Oh, off he goes. Oh, you read me? This is Jan Dolsky. We've got more red smoke over there. I've landed safely, but I think my capsule went astray. Ah, maybe the radio's broken. I love that running noise. I don't know if you can hear that, does it? Like, when, you're, <laughs> when you're running. Another red flare here. Uh, this way. Uh, press A to climb. Nice. Here we go. This way. Oh, nice little jump into the rocks as well. Do like a running jump? No. Oh, there's another capsule here. Oh, no, 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 it's the captain. Shit. Oh, the captain. Oh, deceased. What the hell? Not much I can do for her now. Oh, I gotta, gotta find the others. Something's gone badly oh wrong here. Crash. The capsule's intact. 
Oxygen. Run out Looks of like oxygen. she died inside of him. I don't get it. Is this deliberate? Look at this one. This is stunning. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, parachute up there. Okay, onwards. Mobile base. Oh, yes. Dolsky here. Anyone copy? If you can hear me, I've located the base. I'm gonna try and get down there. Okay. Maybe they landed closer to the drop off point. I gotta keep moving. Right, down here. Don't wanna fall off. It's a hell of a drop. And here we go into the pitch black alien planet cave. Love oil water. Is it dangerous to step in it? No, it's not. Right, getting our sprint on here. Oh, look at all the capsules down there. The capsules. So we're the only one left alive. Oh, warning! Radiation. Whoa. Now. Oh shit! It's rising fast. Christ! Uh, this way. Whoa. Look at the screen. The little flickers. Oh, this radiation is going fast. Oh, let's get to the base, man. Come on, Jan. Run. That looks insane, that base. Look at that. Come on, Jan. Keep going. Keep going. Yes. The elevator. Quick. Get in the lift, man. Come on. Come on. Day one. Hello? Anybody here? Okay, so this is our <sighs> ship, our base. For a moment, I hope someone else made it. New task, is anyone here? I home? need to find the comms room and get help. Oh, comms room, okay. Uh, press base over here. Oh, look at that. So, comms room, one level up. Getting the lift. We've got quantum computer here. Well, wow. there's something you'd find in a Reaper. Let's get to the comms room. Make a call to Earth. Unknown online. Hello. Hello. Can anyone hear me? Mayday! Mayday, anyone? Yeah, uh, this is the new captain speaking. Great! Um, yeah, uh, this is the new captain of the mission speaking, Jan Dolsky. Corporate ID 4672B. I'm afraid the former captain is gone. Together with the rest of the crew. Hello? Can you get me out of here? You're in imminent danger. Only oh, one time remaining to see. Uh, what danger? Imminent danger of what? What do you mean? Remaining to what?
talk to me. What's the danger? No, 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 don't you go all fuzzy on me. Proximity. Oh, you quantum nav system. Where the hell did it send us? Lethal proximity of what? Please, we can be the real force of Dark Rose. This battle, you must escape. The maximum Dark Rose. You mean, you mean a, a star will come and, and burn this planet? And I, and I just have days to escape? Is that right? Sunrise. Perfect. Day two, sunrise in eight days. Okay, we've got eight days to get off this planet then, right? Right, gather six metals outside. Let's go for it. Uh, airlock. Right, shallow deposits. You can find shallow deposits on the planet's surface. Right, where we're we headed. Yeah, I'll sprint on here. Parachute over there. Might be something. Press to open up the map. Okay. Hey, looks like our ship's cargo drop. Oh, cargo drop. Calendar lava lamp. <laughs> okay, take that. Yeah, this is one of the things they told me to take on the mission. Things that will make you feel comfortable far away from home. Objects that trigger good memories. Oh, here we go. What's this? Typical corporate yeah. bullshit. Nothing. Ah, here we go, here we go. The source of metals. Wow, look at it. Right, what do we do here? Extract. Oh, look at that. It kind of just speeds up time, but you still see him do it. Build a workshop in the command center. Can I extract anything else? Is there any more anywhere? No? Okay, let's get indoors then. Build a workshop. Oh, hang on, is that something there? That parachute? While we're out here? Uh, it's appeared to be. Good. Oh, what's this? More materials? Might as well extract it while we're here, right? Deposit. Right, cool. We've got plenty of metals now. Build a workshop in the command center. The graphics are stunning here in this game. Uh, right, command center was here. Cool. Uh, base building. Oh, nice. Open the build menu. Workshop. Great. Uh, let's put it... Oh. There. Workshop. Cool. Craft a scanner. So, here. Scanner. In the queue. And then, is it coming off this conveyor belt? Oh, I have to do it, do I? Work. Oh, there we go. Look at that, man. Right. Find an organics deposit area. Organics matter. Oops, it is it. Oh, my God. Right. Uh, don't need to go anywhere, do I? I can go out this way. Airlock to planet surface. Here we go. Got to be mindful of that radiation. Um, organics. Uh, first step, scanning a deep deposit is find the deposit area. Blue smoke. Oh, blue smoke over there. Do we have stamina here or can we just run like unlimited? 
this from one unlimited. Organic steep deposit, here we go. Right, let's get. Oh, I need a climbing hook. Okay. Can I go this way round? Map. Uh, oh, well, there's something here. Let's sort of let's go this way. What the hell's happening to the camera here? What's going on? Everything's like raising up off the ground. What the hell? What the hell's Rapidium? Rapidium? What the hell's that? Gather three Rapidium samples. I have to get closer. Make sure. What the hell? I need to collect a sample. How the hell do I do that? Oh, right. Extract. Drilling away. Deposit. Cool. Report your findings. Well, I need the organic store. Unbelievable. So the useless quantum nav system isn't that useless after all. Okay, go. Where it was sending us. Except. So there's got to be more to the story about him being the only survivor, right? I should look for organics here. What the hell is this? Scanning. Scanner allows you to find resource deposits. Find the deepest spot. Okay. Hold LT. And select the scanner. Uh, so do that. And then... That. Then... Oh no. That. And then that. Oh, what? Hold LT. Select mining outpost. That one there. Uh, okay. Place on the. Oh, here. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, place. Wow, look at that. Bloody hell. Pylons. Connect pylons with the base. Each pylon automatically connects to nearby structures. You can see possible connections in form of green lines when you have the pylon equipped. Right, hold LT. That one. Uh, this one. Pylon. Nice. Right, so I need to go back to my ship, which is over here. Is there a limit to how far I can take it? There clearly is. Uh, oh, there. Right, then I have to... Can I get down this way? Eh? Oh, nice. Oh, oh sugar. I've run out of... That. Okay. This way. Why has it got two? I still can't believe it. If it really is Rebidium. This could change everything. I need to report it. That's what we're doing, man. We're working our way back over to report it. Let's go right as close as we can. Oh, not quite nine feet. Do I have to connect it to the lift? To the elevator? I've got two pylons left. Oh, look, it just does it Ooh, automatically. That's good. So I can drop that now. Yes. Right, let's get back indoors. Right, I need to report my findings for the Rapidium. So let's make a call back to the static man, whoever he is. Hello? Anyone copy? I went out to find resources and I found a cave full of something. I think it might be Rapidium. You hear me? I think I found Rapidium. You should have it. Uh, I'm sure. What? I... I'm sure. Yeah, I mean... What else could it be? 
Test it. Test the Rapidium? How would I do that? New blueprint provided. The womb. A blueprint? The womb. You want me to build a womb? Uh, who are you? Who are you? The womb, huh? So we have to build a DNA sample. Womb? What? what the hell? I guess it makes sense. Rapidium Whoa. speeds up organic growth. Okay, uh, let's go base building. That's what we want, isn't it? Yep. Oh my goodness gracious. Uh, build. So we need the womb. A soundproof cell growth capsule on Earth. There. Nice. Okay. So that is... Okay, so I have built a womb now what could possibly come out of it right so this is the womb is it standing by right test rapidium so what the hell we're going to grow something here are we here goes DNA sample rapidium <laughs> DNA have Sorry, we got worry, this wasn't such a good idea what the heck it's a sheep. <laughs> oh. Of course. What Lamb else? chops on the menu tonight. <laughs> oh, we've got a pet sheep. Oh. If you need a name, I think I'm going to call you Molly. Molly. Can we interact with Molly? There you go. <laughs> Hello, Molly. Bye, do you? Ah, oh. cool. We've got a sheep. Uh, right, report the results. Oh my god. Okay, right. Back to the team's room. Right, online. Okay, I built the womb and uh, tested the rapidium. The DNA sample provided was a little surprising, but it worked. I think I cloned a sheep. Hello? Can you hear me? I, I have a sheep on board. You're responsible for two lives now. Uh, will you help me now? The must do. We've got sheep on board, man. Come on. Yeah. Now that I'm a real hero, I could use some real assistance. Uh, respond to message? Right, well, what can we even say? I know that. But I'm just a builder. I'm not trained to move the goddamn base all by myself. You're the captain now, man. Day three, sunrise in seven days. I thought we're on day two still. <laughs> right, 7 a.m. sharp. Let's go and get this organic matter. Up a level to the airlock. Let's go. Uh, oh, I can fast travel too. Right, can we fast travel to here? Nice. Okay, that's great. And it doesn't actually take any time off me either. It's still 7 o'clock in the morning. Okay, let's work. I love how this just speeds up the work. It doesn't kind of just fade to black and then come back again. Like it might on other games. I need eight of these things, do I? And my controller is going crazy here. Vibrating. Build a kitchen. Let's finish. Oh, I wanted to finish at two o'clock. Okay, build a kitchen. Can I uh, quickly go anywhere else? There was some glowing orange over there. Jump down here. Straight through the pylon. I've got plenty of time, so I'm not doing too badly here. We're going back in this funny Rapidium cave here. But if we hang a left when we get to the top, 
so not there but here we should maybe find an opening here we go and there's the base we're not too far away from the base just an, a massive Pirelli isn't it with some shipping containers on it I think by the looks of it uh, oh can I do anything here no right any mining to be done here yeah, a little bit. Oh, look at this. Here we go. Let's get some more materials. Nice. We're doing good here. Let's just get one more and then start making our way over to the base. Oh, no storage space. Oh, gosh. Okay, I'm going to have to build some stuff then, aren't I? Can we get down anywhere? This way. This is such a good looking game looking at my name. It's raining permanently here, but it's still a beautiful, beautiful game. What's around here? Uh, oh, nothing. We're just going back up again. Let's go under this archway then. I don't know what this seven is in the bottom corner. I don't know what I've got seven of. I've not eaten yet either. I don't know where food is. Do I have to do anything with that? Build a kitchen, I guess I'm going to make some food, to be fair. Uh, anything over here? I've got time here. Time is on my side, just to have a little run around. See if there's anything. Oh, hang on, there's a pod. What's this? Multi tool. Convenient set, one of few things everyone should always have in their pocket. Oh, wow. Nice. What's missing? What can I do with it? The water, man. Uh, right. There's a little. When you move the camera, the kind of frames just lag ever so slightly. I know it's a demo. So I can't really treat it too harshly. There's the tire. It is literally just one big tire, isn't it? Look at it, my god. I presume it rolls at some point. Oh, what's this? Energy full. Oh, okay. Right, let's get in the lift. Right, base building. Need to build a kitchen. Workshop. Build a uh, kitchen. Uh kitchen prepare six mush meals where have I put the kitchen uh oh to where I am now same level cool right let's go that's the airlock kitchen you consume one meal each day meals can prepare oh so I've been having them automatically have I so the seven must be meals I have to do six so there's what times two so one two three in the queue Basic meal in the form of in insipid pulp. <laughs> okay. Right. Let's start cooking. Oh, you ran out of work energy and became tired. In this state, physical work takes much longer. You should avoid working while being tired. Oh, man. Can I still... Do I have to go to bed now? Can I still do this? Or do I like what will happen? No storage. Oh god, after all that, no storage space. Right, let's go to bed. I wanna have to get something out of storage, Anna. Uh come on. Oh what on earth? Stay still. Down. Oh that was Bit of a drop of frame right there, wasn't it? Right, okay, cool, let's go to bed. Uh, and if we wake up at... I can wake up at 9am. I think, yeah. Day four. Right, prepare some meals. Ah, that's weird, isn't it? Look at that. 
Right, kitchen, come on, man. Let's cook. No storage space. Uh, what the hell can I do for storage, then? Go down to... Oh, hang on. I thought these were my storage rooms down here. Oh, my goodness. Can I actually get to storage? Right, I don't know what to do now. Uh... Ah, storage. Cool. Oh, I'll tell you what I might do. Uh, build... If I build... Something. The hook, maybe. Because I've got... What do I have? Do it. Cool. So I've got a climbing hook now. Start the engines in the command centre. Oh. Good. Uh, this is it. So the meals just was done automatically there. This one? Oh, a test engine. Here we go. Fire up. What the hell was that? What just happened? Turn the lever in machinery. Next level down. Machinery. This one? Yes. Okay, that's sorted. Let's give it another go. Okay. Here we go, try again, let's fire this girl up. What? Oh, Christ again. again. Turn the lever in the machinery. One more time. Oh fire. What the hell? You have got to be kidding me. Got a call and coming. My luck to be stuck in a junkyard. Wrong room. Whoa. Let's have a look. Right. Okay. Here we go. Call the RSE. Hey, you still there? I really need your help. I can't get out of here. I did everything according to the manual, but there's a malfunction I can't fix. I just don't know how. Repeating. Uh, I don't have access to QC, whatever that even is. Only the captain has access codes to the quantum computer. Oh, QC, quantum yes. computer. Man, that was easy. Right, so, check your data consistency in the QC. Here we go, quantum computer. What do I do? Analyze data from mind records, what the hell? records What's going on? Is this our DNA? Some slots, zoom, select life event. What on earth? Turning a blind eye. Another shitty day at school. You're taking the longer route home. Hey, what's that fight about? The boy shouts for help. He's looking straight at you. But intervene, but the fear. No, better not get involved. How did they get in it? What for? How's Molly? thought I'd be so glad to see a sheep. Yeah, what a good girl. Right. Contact Ally Corp. There we go. I can finally move. <laughs> I was just stuck on the spot. Uh, right, let's make the call. Here we go. Hey. I checked the quantum computer. Uh, what the fuck? Mine records? What the fuck? Mind records? What the hell are you doing with that data? It's got everything. My whole life exposed. 
No. No, I want answers. Shit. Uh, what next? What do you want with it? Uh, what does it do? Branching? What exactly will be branching? Us, me. What? What? You what? Is that your whole answer? <laughs> alter what? Alternate us? Alter? Is it? I alter what? Uh, okay, so what are we... My life? Okay. You mean as in... Okay, wait a minute. You're not suggesting I... Use Rapidium to create a... Someone. And to alter their mind. That's uh, not what you're saying, right? Clearly is. Alright, how about my other options? <laughs> Jerk. I don't have other options, do I? What the hell? So we're making a clone human now? Uh, oh, in the QC, sorry. Yeah. I'll tell you what, I bet we're not too far away from this in real life, are we? Branching procedure. Here we go. Searching for the branching point. Uh, I I remember that alternate life path. So this is what the branching is about. Uh, oh, so we go to this little spanner here, wrench, whatever. Staying at home, moving away. So this is what we did, wasn't it? Moving away. If we go here, technician plus fifty percent efficiency when doing base maintenance. So had we stayed at home, you lock the door to your room and turn the music up. You're so fed up with his constant shouting. Is this what you rejected college for? Putting up with his frustration and drunkenness? You told yourself you'd take care of Mam, but he's not making it easy. Maybe next time, you should just lock the door for him. But what would Mam say? Okay, so. Oh, here we go.
Hello? Uh, hey, hey, hey there. Uh, wow, um, hello. Hello? Can, can you hear me? Uh, I, uh, what is this? Anxiety, insecurity. Where am I? Also, showing us his mental state. Uh, relax, you know, let's try and put him at ease here. You're in a lab, relax. You're in a lab inside the SIBA unit. Your memories might be a bit fuzzy, but relax. You're gonna be okay. Yeah, I recognize the base. You look funny. You... Ha ha. Oh. What was that? I wanted to laugh, but I'm like... Indifferent. I think you're on some meds. What? What for? It's so you don't panic when you wake up. Why would I panic? I'll... I'll explain later. Right now... Let's check your mental condition, okay? Do you think you can, uh, introduce yourself? Sure. But can you? Well, I asked you first, but, uh, okay, that's just, um, Jan Dolsky. Oh, okay. Uh, my name is Jan Dolsky. <laughs> Fun. Yes, get yeah. in there. Sure. You got my looks. Why not use my name, too? So you think you're Jan Dolsky as well? What kind of bullshit is this? Hmm? What's your role on the mission? I'm a senior technician. Want to tell me what your role is? Imitating human crew members? Is this some kind of sick experiment? Because if it is, nobody warned me. Uh, what? Experiment? Uh, just to say, oh my god, what do I do? Uh, no, it's not. It's not an experiment. This is for real. And I'm for real. So, oh. what's going on? Anxiety, discontent. Well, I got stranded in this base, and, um, well, I needed someone to help me move it. Because it got broken. Then, okay, this is the crazy part. I learned that there's this functionality of the quantum computer on board to, uh, well, create alternate versions of a person's life. What? Replicate a person, but with different experiences. Mind records. <laughs> if there's anyone in a bad mental condition in this room, it's definitely not me. The QC's only functionality is to navigate these junkets. I mean, theoretically, it could do other stuff, but such bullshit. I know, it's absurd. I thought the same, but here you are, right? Right. And if I understand you correctly, you're telling me you're a alternate version of me with a different mind? Uh, let's, oh, okay, yes, you can put it that way. I'm trying to ease him here. Sort of, yeah. And uh, oh, less glue. Said we were we stranded. Less security. Yes. It's just us. Like I said, there's a malfunction in the machinery. If you don't help me fix it soon, we're both gonna die. So wait. Let me get this straight. This is not an experiment, and you're a different version of me. This version of me. Woke me from cryosleep to help fix a malfunction because there's no one else on board. What if there was no malfunction? Where would I be? Uh, you'd still exist somewhere. I wouldn't wake you up. Let's be, just be honest. I wouldn't wake you up. I won't lie to you. I created, I mean, woke you up because I needed you. It wasn't easy for me either. At least you're up front. Oh, less frustration, less rebellion. You bastard. Oh, he hates us. <sighs> I can see now what the meds are for. I can't 
not even lash out. Oh, now we're rebellion now. Just this passiveness. What am I? Look, this is a lot, and we'll sort it out. I promise. But trust me, if we don't fix the machinery fast, we're gonna go in a very bad way, and you'll never get the chance to understand this properly. Experience your feelings without the meds. <sighs> I don't like this kind of pressure. Well, oh, frustration, Rebecca. I'm not doing a very good job here. Fine. What a screw up. The three year old would have figured it out. Okay. In any other case, I'd say don't touch anything here ever again. But unfortunately, this is a two man job. On my sign, pull that lever over there. Just don't yank it like an idiot. Pull it gently. Ready? One, two, three, now. Yes! <laughs> it worked! You did it. We're gonna live. Let's get one thing straight. I did what you created me for. Oh, he hates us. Now stay away from me. Was there any way to have that conversation right? Jan Technician is born. LB? LB? Doesn't do it. Doesn't do anything. LB? Doesn't do anything. I don't know why it doesn't do anything at all. Uh, start the engines in the command centre. Right, let's go. Let's get this wheel on the move. Why the hell did that just flash like that? Glitch so bad. Uh, here we go. Command centre. Oh, there we go. That's incredible. Journey 1. We're just rolling, are we? Can we look out the window, see where we are? Press and navigate to the altars tab. The altars tab allows you to check the mental and physical state of your altars. The event log on the left provides insights into recent events. hell frustration rebellion day six i'm pissed off at jan he's really irritating <laughs> he looks a bit annoyed talk to the altar where is he no he's in the kitchen here we go jan talk Hello. Hey there. I said, don't come near me. Uh, I understand you're angry, but we need your help. I get it. You're angry. I, I would be too. But I could really use your help. Oh, you know, frustration. If we manage what? to get the comms room running properly, we'd probably be able to get out of here faster. Stop pretending you have any idea how I feel. I don't give a damn about your comms room. We're moving, aren't we? Now get out of my face, creep. I think I'm gonna have to be direct. Uh, you do the same, yeah. You're pissed off at me now. Oh, God, Deep more. down, we both know you do the same thing. Really? You said it yourself. We might look alike, but we're different. Like oil and water, if you ask me. And they don't mix well. I know you, I created you. Maybe, but we're in this together. Uh, I know you, I created you. I know you well enough. Oh, more rebellion I content. I created you. Wow. Playing God already. I can't believe we have the same DNA. Why don't you get yourself a repair kit and fix your own shit? I'm done doing your dirty work. That did not go well. Modules deteriorate over time, which makes them prone to failures. To repair the communication room, you'll need a repair kit. You can craft one in the workshop. Okay. He just straight up does not like me. Right, repair kit. 
Oh, nice. Right, got it. Uh, let's go up to the comms room. Time seems to have stopped. It's not... Oh, look at it. What the hell? Work. There we go. Right, what do we do? Answer the call. Someone's calling us. Lucas. Who the hell's this? Uh, hello? Uh, Mr. Dalski? Yeah, uh, yes, I'm, I'm, I'm here. Are you okay? Uh, I'm okay, I guess. I think so. I, I was almost done for it, but then I got these crazy instructions to duplicate and edit myself was that you uh yeah it, it's called branching the duplicating and editing thing i need to know if you pulled it off really and i need to know who i'm talking to i didn't catch your name oh uh, lucas pena space traffic control orbital substation l7 now the branching did you do it Space traffic control it doesn't sound very senior, I guess, does he? Yes, thanks. Yeah, I created my altar. Thanks for the help, I think. Is this even legal? You found Rapidium, Mr. Dolsky. We needed to act. Uh, what went wrong with the landing? What the hell happened out there? What went wrong with the landing? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. I'm still analyzing telemetry data from your flight, but it seems something went very wrong. Well, no shit. If we've all no crushed. Kidding. Yeah. We know there was a major system malfunction, but the reasons are unclear. It's too early to tell. We need more data. Why did everyone die? Do you know what killed the rest of the crew? Looks like an oxygen leak in the landing pods. No idea why, though. Then how come I survived? You tell me. You know, you're not very informative. I don't like confusing assumptions with information, Mr. Dolsky. Conclusive evidence is more my thing. What are the mind records? What about the mind records? What is all that personal data doing in the base computer? Oh, that's, um, uh, the, the corporation needs to ensure the safety of the mission and, uh, basically everyone. It's confidential, of course. And it kind of saved your life. Uh, I never consented. I bet we didn't even know. I don't recall consenting to it. Well, you must have, since it's there. Maybe you didn't read your contract thoroughly. They like to put these things in fine print, you know. Always the small print. Uh, give me someone higher up. I want to talk to someone higher up. Do you have a boss? Uh, I might sound... I might sound young, Mr. Dolsky, but I'm not here by accident. No offense, man. I just need to know this stunt was authorized by someone. Look... I'm on my own here at the station. But I contacted my boss, and we're good. Nothing to worry about. Karen Dolsky, demanding the manager. Uh, have you done this before? Have you done this before? That would be hard, considering there's no Rapidium on Earth. So how did you know what would happen? I, I didn't know. I anticipated the outcome based on historic data. What historic data? Some old research. Nothing important. Okay, let's get out of here. So, you're getting me out of here, right? You know how to do it. Safely. Sure. First thing I'll need you to do is to transport the base to a safe and accessible destination. I'll dispatch the coordinates to you. Second thing... Do you think I could see this altar of yours? 
Uh, oh, how do you know you're not talking to him? Here we go. Let's play with him. How do you know you're not talking to him right now? You're joking, right? Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. <laughs> nice try, but I'd know the difference. The emo's a present meds. He wouldn't be in a disposition to mess around. How bad is he feeling? He's pissed off at me. Won't cooperate. Then we have a problem. You won't manage without his help. The base needs more hands on deck. There should be a way to gain his trust. Sh show him you care, maybe? I told him I wouldn't survive without him. Yeah, that's just words. Maybe you should share something. What? Why? I don't know. Just a thought. My grandma used to say, sharing is caring. Yay. Let me think. What can I share with him? My playlist? Yeah, true. Wait, suppose it's not about what you can share with him, but what you already do. Uh, memories, surely, right? With the same person underneath? Of course. Memories? I wonder if he remembers things the same way I do. Yeah. Mind records. See? You were so spooked by them, they could be a source of information. Fine. I'll check them out, see what happens. Shit, I, uh, gotta go now. Urgent call. I'll get back to you as soon as you reach your destination. Don't worry, you're in good hands. L7 out. Okay, read about the altar's life in the QC. You can learn more about your altar's life and choices by analysing his life path in the quantum computer module. Here we go. So, ah, look, so this is where we branched off and then it went up here, didn't it? You laugh as Mam tells you a joke she heard in the doctor's waiting room. She's cooked her pierogi. Man, don't you love them? And her relaxed, smiling face when she can be herself without that monster bullying her. You just wish you could find more than a part-time job to support the two of you. The prescriptions she brought home today is going to cost you plenty. Here we go, ask the altar about the memories you share. Uh, where's the altar? In the kitchen again. He spends his whole time in the kitchen. I've been thinking about what you said. I've been thinking about what you said. Uh, we have more in common than you think. We have more in common than you think. Yeah. Oh God! Again, frustration, like what? rebellion. Uh, parents. Same DNA, raised by the same parents. That's quite a fair bit, don't you think? Not enough. Oh apparently. God, more. Uh, you stood up to Dad. Here we go. Maybe standing up to Dad changed you. It's something I never did. Oh, really? Now what did you do? Just stand and watch him take it out on Mom? I thought about stepping in. I was always a, a heartbeat away from doing it, but when it came down to it, I'd just freeze. Guess I was afraid of making things worse. Yeah, I remember the feeling. But then I reached a breaking point. Looks like you didn't hang around long enough to reach yours. Uh, I was a coward. Or maybe I was a coward. Going to college was a good excuse to just get away from it all. Oh, oh, less so frustration, less anxiety. Split. Did you shine out there? Were you best in class? What do you think? Huh? Yeah. The build around this merry-go-round. That's who I ended up being. Sorry to disappoint. Why would I be disappointed? Just proves I was right to stick with Mom. Wait, is Mom... Is she maybe still around, here? No. 
where she was. She always knew what to do, and how to cheer you up. Hey, when you were down, or Dad had just stormed out of the house, slamming the door behind him and leaving you crying in your room, would she ask me to help her make pierogi? Her pierogi, famous pierogi. that's what it is. Pierogi. Oh my god, I could really pig out on those. Oh, yeah, he's warming to us. Fun. fun. Less gloom. Fun. Yeah. Wow. Why don't we go for it? Why don't we try and make Mom's famous pierogi? I no way we'd find the ingredients here. Uh, beer and synthetic starch. Because we can't use coolant and oil. Jesus Christ. Beer and synthetic starch. Who said they have to be right? Beer and synthetic starch should work. Yeah. Hilarious. Here we go. He's smiling. I can pull it off. You'll see. But there's one condition. You're eating them with me. If you die, I die. Why not? Won't change much, I guess. Oh, wow. Okay, here we go. Uh, prepare pierogi. You know, pierogi in the kitchen. Right. Pierogi, here we go. Not quite like Mum used to make them, but they have a nostalgic taste. Nice. Don't need to. Don't need to make two. Work. Here we go. Eat pierogi with the altar. Right. Here we go. Here you are. The famous Dolsky pierogi with an interstellar twist. What do you think? Oh. Now I know how Mom must have felt. That day she had a terrible flu and I decided to cheer her up and make pierogi for her. Right. Yeah. I put like a ton of salt into the filling. And I overcooked them into a shapeless pulp. They were inedible. But you remember what she did? Uh-huh. She ate them all and never said a word. No, no. She said they were delicious. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Oh, look at that. They're bonded so, now. Best of friends. They're delicious, man. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Bros, get in there. Talk with the altar. Where's he at? Oh, he's in the womb. Oh my god. Right. Let's catch up with this guy here. Jan, talk. Oh, he's speaking to the sheep as well. So. 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 Are we cool? Are we cool now? Oh, no, what? You mean, did I come to terms with waking up as tech support for my doppelganger? You might have to give me something stronger than dehydrated dumplings to wrap my head around that. Uh, they weren't that bad. Oh god, do I try and make a joke? Oh, I sod it. Now you're being mean. Oh, there we go. I went through a lot of trouble to make those, and they weren't that bad. But you made an effort. I'll give you that. But see, that makes it even worse. It would be easier than you, but eating those fucking pierogi with you, I actually enjoyed it. Uh, are you showing feelings? Probably the wrong question to ask. So did I. So did I. Sharing these memories with you, knowing you understand me, that was kind of comforting. Are you getting mushy with me? Oh, he's gone green. What? Fun. No. Less gloom. Okay. Okay. Just kidding. I know what you mean. I'm just... Not the sentimental type. Who's being sentimental? All I said was... Alright, alright. Just... Tell me what the plan is. Uh... We need to handle this our way. Corporation is supposedly on top of this, but I know better than to put my life in the hands of pet pushers. Oh, I hear you. You 
never know with those numbskulls. Right, so, until the rescue ship arrives, we better watch our own asses. Do they know about me? Uh. Oh god, leave the politics to me. No, let's be honest, be honest with him. They were the ones who told me to create you. Bastards. Oh, it's gone red again. Don't believe it. Tell me you know what to do. Uh, we'll improvise. All I know is we need to get to a safe place. Then, we'll improvise. Well, there's one thing you should know. Going green. This base is a resource-consuming, maintenance-heavy sucker to operate. I have you to help me. That's not gonna be enough. I'll be blunt with you. If you want to survive, you're gonna need more people. People? What people? More of us. idioms there. Use it. Make more versions of me. Versions of us, you mean, bro? Versions of us both, you mean. Huh. <laughs> That almost sounded like we're planning kids. Oh my god. You need to work on your cooking skills, though. Uh, I can't wait to do it again. Let's be friendly. Actually, I can't wait to branch myself. Oh, out. that's not what I meant. I thought you were talking sure. about cooking. Take the bull by the horns. Oh, at least he's gone green. Good luck keeping him happy. Are you real? More real than you, I'm afraid. So, where's the captain? I told you, everyone died. Oh, this is insane, what a trip. It's not a trip, it's reality. Your new reality. Are, are we brothers or something? We have the same DNA, but we led separate lives. What the hell? Calm down. You're not the original Jan, but that doesn't mean you can't be important. Well, you look like me, but also God like me. What the fuck did you drug me with, man? No, you're not hallucinating. That was The Alters, a sci-fi survival game coming out later this year and we are just getting started with this one. If you want to see me play this in full on release, drop a like, let me know in the comments and please subscribe if you aren't already. Do you remember who you are? My name is Jan Dolsky, but I'm seeing fucking double, you should worry about that. This is 88-Bit Gaming, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.